channel for physics. Please subscribe my channel. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Physics Partner. Today we will be discussing the advantages and disadvantages of the two types of energy resources. Renewable energy resources and non-renewable energy resources. Renewable energy resources are resources of energy that can be replenished naturally and relatively quickly such as wind, solar, geothermal, hydro and biomass. On the other hand, non-renewable energy resources are sources of energy that cannot be replenished in a short period such as coal, oil and natural gas. Let us start by discussing the advantages of renewable energy resources. Firstly, renewable energy resources are cleaner and more sustainable than non-renewable energy resources. They do not emit harmful gases and pollutants that cause harm to the environment and human health, reducing the risk of climate change and air pollution. Renewable energy resources also have minimal water usage and land requirements, meaning that they do not harm natural resources, leading to reduced natural resource depletion rates. Secondly, renewable energy resources are now cheaper to produce on a large scale than non-renewable resources, which are becoming increasingly expensive as they move forwards scarcity. This is especially true for solar and wind power, which are getting much cheaper due to technological advances and economies of scale. Thirdly, renewable energy resources are an excellent source of employment opportunities, especially in rural areas where energy costs are usually high and job opportunities are scarce. The rising demand for renewable energy is also leading to the creation of more jobs in various fields such as construction, manufacturing, project development and installation. Turning our focus to the disadvantages of renewable energy resources. One disadvantage is their intermittent and unpredictable nature. Renewable energy resources such as solar, wind and hydroelectric power depend largely on weather conditions, making it difficult to predict and control the amount of energy produced. It also means that they need to be complemented with energy storage systems, which can be expensive. Secondly, renewable energy resources required more rigorous upkeep and maintenance than non-renewable energy resources. Such maintenance needs can sometimes lead to increased cost. Lastly, renewable energy resources require large land areas to generate enough energy to supply vast quantities of energy and can cause or static problems. Some individuals detest an unsightliness of wind farms which tend to be erected on hilltop and wilderness areas. Let's now talk about the advantages of non-renewable energy resources. Firstly, non-renewable energy resources have consistent energy generation profiles making it easier for countries to predict and manage their energy budgets. They are also relatively cheap to produce on a large scale compared to renewable energy resources. Secondly, non-renewable energy resources are easily transportable. The use of pipelines, ships, trucks and rails make it easy to efficient to move oil, gas and coal from where they are mined to where they are used. Lastly, non-renewable energy sources provide a nearly unlimited possibility for research and further development over time as new and innovative ways are being explored to extract them with as minimum carbon emissions as possible. Turning our focus to the disadvantage of non-renewable energy resources. Firstly, they produce harmful emissions that contribute significantly to climate change and global environmental degradation. The carbon emissions due to non-renewable energy resources lead to dangerous climate change patterns and negative climate events. It is estimated that non-renewable energy resources continue to contribute significantly to global greenhouse gas emission that cause climate change. Secondly, non-renewable energy resources rely on finite and non-recoverable resources such as fossil fuels and natural gas. This means they will eventually run out leading to the extensive exhaustion of the earth natural resources. Additionally, the use of non-renewable energy resources is often linked to political tensions as countries compete over oil reserves and gas pipeline. To sum up, renewable energy resources are appearing to be feasible solution to meet the world's increasing demand for energy. Their advantages including clean and sustainable energy that would prolong the use of natural resources for generations to come.
Despite these advantages, the cost benefit of such renewable energy resources remain a debated issue among researchers, scholars, and policy makers. Non renewable energy resources, on the other hand, notwithstanding their advantages, pose significant challenges due to their effect on the environment, political stability, technological advancement, and dependence on non renewable resources with finite reserves. I think it's enough for today. So thank you very much for listening and watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this video is useful for you. So take care of yourself and don't hesitate to write an email if you have any question, query, suggestion and even classes are required. Take care of yourself. Meanwhile, see you in the next video. Goodbye.